the hazards that face young animals, of course, vary. And amongst um, many animals, the great majority of the young which they produce will not survive, which means, therefore, that the animal, if it is to hand on its genes to the next generation, has to produce a lot of young. And the, the winnowing out, the uh, loss of great numbers of offspring, in some instances, happens really right from the very beginning. I mean, um, barnacle geese in the Sears, for example, they make their nests on the top of cliffs because they're on the ground, there's a lot of predators. And in this instance, they're cliffs which are 300 feet high. They are safe up there from the predation of Arctic foxes. Uh, but when the young hatch, how are they to get down to the water where they will live? Uh, and there's only one way of doing it, and that is to jump. And you see these, these little balls of little, tiny little fluffy ducklings leaping into the abyss, 300 feet. A significant proportion of them are killed as a consequence. The very first act of their young lives is death. Um, but a few survive. <laughs>